Now to the war in Ukraine. Russia says its air defenses stopped four Ukrainian drones overnight, including two near Moscow. And for the first time since his failed mutiny against Russian commanders in June, Wagner Group leader Yevgeny Prigozhin has appeared in a new video. Deborah Pata has more from Ukraine. Deborah, good morning. Good morning. Well, the future of the Wagner mercenary group has been unclear since their leader, Yevgeny Prigozhin, led a failed mutiny against the Russian military establishment in June. But it seems Prigozhin is starved of the oxygen of constant public attention and has finally posted his first video since that march on Moscow and certainly seems to be on a recruitment drive. Here he is with a rifle in his hand and hinting He's somewhere in Africa. We can't verify the location or when it was filmed. He says that Wagner is making Russia great on all continents and, get this, Africa more free. Now, we know from our own investigations that this is simply not the case. The Sahel region in Africa has been rendered deeply unstable by multiple coups, the most recent in Niger. But that presents business opportunities for Wagner. However, in places like the Central African Republic, our investigations show that Wagner is plundering the country's mineral resources in exchange for protecting the president against a coup. And that wherever Wagner has a presence on the African continent, it's also been accused of horrific human rights violations. For CBS Mornings, Deborah Padder, Eastern Ukraine.